that the letter simply recites free existing facts and admonishment and is not Marco's own electoral creation. And the tableau says is that since the letter is not drafting the letter on an iPhone's notes application before carefully copying it out by hand, also she allegedly lost to help the Kensington Palace brass team, including then communication secretary Jason Knopf in composing the letter punishment to him, the document added. The defendant's case is all of those pre-existing facts and admonishment as such are not themselves a part of any literacy intellectual creation of the claimant and therefore not original in the copyright sense. The tenant Jason Knopf and or others in Kensington Palace communication team contribute to the writing of electronic draft. Precisely which parts were the result of such contribution is uniquely known to claimant Jason Knopf and others in the team. It is also argued Marco claimed that the publication was a misuse of her private information, but the British tabloid argued that the content in the letter was not solely Marco's. The Telegraph obtained the court documents filed by Mill on Sunday, alleging that Marco spent several weeks trial for Marco's privacy case against the British publication was scheduled for January. However, the judge moved it at least nine months after the Duchess requested to delay it on confidential grounds. The delay sparked speculations that Marco is pregnant, but Duke and Duchess of Sussex didn't address the pregnancy rumor. Megan Marco sought help to write letter to dad, court documents claim. Megan Marco has to prove that she was ready owns all contents in a wholly original. Marco is not protected by the copyright. The whole letter compromised uh, reflect situations of facts both past and present, including the claimant's views as to a father and his conduct and an admin. It is for the claimant to prove that she was the only person who contributed to the writing of the electronic draft, Melon Sunday's falling red. Without prejudice to the generality of the foregoing, defendant Inverse had a letter that she sent to her dad that mail on Sunday published, according to the court documents filed by defendant Royals. The Duchess of Sussex is suing Mail on Sunday's publisher Associated Newspaper after the tabloid published her private letter 